Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel. Today, we are going back in the local arcade so we can check out the battle mode. Now, battle mode in CTR is not something I'm super familiar with, but we do have every single battle arena for CTR and CNK, and then maybe some new ones as well. Like, yeah, like the North Bowl, totally not familiar with. So like some of these might just be totally new, but I'm super excited to check them out. There's quite a lot of them, so we might as well just go ahead and get started with the first one. And you can see there's different types of battles. Maybe we'll try each one with different maps. So we have limit battle this time. Score points by hitting enemies with your favorite power-ups. Let's go. And there'll be one player, but the limit will be, let's do time limit. Let's do, okay, three minutes is the lowest, and we'll do that. Teams, none. There could be, I guess, like multiple teams. Yeah, we'll just do solo. AI count is four, that seems fair. Difficulty is medium, and we can choose which power-ups are available. There are some exclusive power-ups, like this right here. I know is exclusive, and this is exclusive to um, battle mode, so they'll be fun to check out. So yeah, we're good. Of course, some of these tracks we've checked out, and I'll play different characters later on, but um, some of these tracks we've checked out in the story mode for the Crystal Collection games, so it should be pretty similar to that. I'm excited. Okay, starting with Skull Rock. Yeah, this was from uh, Crash Cove. But this time we're not collecting crystals, we are beating up enemies. I don't see any of them. Oh, I do see an orange triangle though. So let's see what I get first. I get a rocket. Oh, will that get him? Oh, not quite. We just right by him. That's sort of a shame. Player one is leading, that's me, right? Okay, that's good. Oh, I got the, I got the thing there, but some of them must have hit me right away. Oh, it actually hit him. So I have two takedowns you can see in the bottom left. There we go, we get the super boost, which as you can see gives you a blue boost. And then it just like gives it to you multiple times. It's super duper cool, which is great, but what speed without power? Okay, here we go, let's get this. And the blue ones last forever, the blue energy balls. So yeah, Crash Team Racing also has, oh nice, a battle mode. It's not as popular as Mario Kart, but I think it's pretty cool. I would like to try this online at some point, but right now my goal is to showcase all the maps and all the game modes, and to do that, it's just a little bit more efficient to do it against enemies. I'm still in the lead, but all I'm getting is speed boost right now, which is not gonna help me much. I might actually be able to run into an enemy, and oh, that hurt me though, <laughs> yikes. Because he had Aku Aku. Zam is leading right now, that's not good. Come on, I got a bowling ball. I probably need more Wampa Fruit then. So let's grab that, and I would like to win some of these at the least. I, I, I'm probably not gonna win most of them. Okay, we get a potion, I just threw that, which will be helpful just to have potions floating about. Okay, where are these guys at? This guy's in the lead, I need to take him down then. Oh, nope, nope, he didn't go that way. Oh, he almost did. <laughs> okay, I got this. So if I just ran right into him, that would work. Oh, that did work. I hit him, but he's still in the lead. He must have more than four points, wow. Ow, but they got me too. Okay, no, that was a waste. I'm coming over there, maybe. <laughs> Battle mode is just like a whole different playing field, of course. It's really weird. I'm gonna get up here, I don't think I've gone up here. There we go. Got a couple of items. Probably need to get that lump of fruit, but there's a potion protecting, here's one, here's one. There's items everywhere, ow, they keep getting me, they're pretty good. Only got a minute left. Might be easier to do this by points then. At least it'll go by a little bit quicker and seeing how many maps we have to get through. Might do that for the next couple. Hope to see what those game modes are actually like. Cause this one's about items, but there seem to be some other goals for some of them. Like there might even be one where you gotta collect crystals like faster than your opponent, I think. Maybe I'm wrong. It's very fast paced though, for sure. I'm not getting any rockets anymore. No, you don't. Where are they? They're all over here, tussling. Come on, rocket. No, a speed boost, that's mine! No, <laughs> gonna get it. It's back, they pop up really quickly. Here we go, I gotta make sure this doesn't go to waste. Oh, it went to waste, I think. Might be chasing him still. Oh nice, now I get the triple rockets when it's almost too late. And they're not hitting anybody. I got seven points though, that's pretty good. So what's my final score gonna be? We got two seconds left, I don't think I'm gonna get any more points then. I got third, yikes, <laughs> behind Zim and Nitrous Oxide. Okay, well we got in the middle. Stuffed turkey, what is that supposed to mean? I don't know. It's 17 coins for, let's go ahead and change our setup. Is it weird to change our level and everything? We'll change characters too, just for the fun of it. Not really sure who we'll play, but we'll just, we'll do random, that sounds fun. The next one is gonna be Capture the Flag, let's do it on Nitro Core, I really like this track. Uh, capture the Flag, grab the other team's flag and bring it back to your team portal to win big. So we can confirm this, change our character, 
Can I just do, is there a random button? I guess there's not a random button in this game. All right, we'll just do Cortex then for now. Don't really care much about the, the cart. I just wanna get moving, so let's try capture the flag at Nitro Court. This is a really cool track. What I like about it is that it, it feels like Cortex Castle, but like in a different way. And also there's like weird fake crash banners to get the dragon from uh, one of the courses. From Dragon Mines, of course. That's cool. This is like fake crash over here for some reason. <laughs> so where are the flags at? I do see one over here. So the goal is, and this is team based. So I have a teammate right behind me. That's super cool. I got the flag. I gotta be careful because they're gonna be trying to get me. This seems like it'd be really fun online. Oh, and there's an Embryo. I really hope they add Embryo at some point, but there's a banner with him on it. And one with Nina. That's cool. And boom, score! I got it, so you typically, if it's a 2v2 like this, you probably have wanna have like one protector and one attacker. Like they just stole our flag. So probably whoever we're teaming with, I'm not even sure who it is, should probably be protecting it while I grab more. I missed it, really? There it is, okay. Cause that's sort of my goal at the moment, is just to make sure I have them beat by going faster than they do. <laughs> it's sort of my best bet. Okay, bleed team flag dropped. Ow, oh, no wait, where's that flag? Did I get the point? I didn't get the point. Did I do something wrong there? I went through the thing and then uh, whoever that was hit me. Okay, they have a point now, which is not good. Watch it. I need to actually run into it. Can't just go through the little, uh, the ring. But they stole our flag again. So I'm gonna hit that nitro. Apparently we're still in the lead. So why is that not working now? Oh, maybe because our flag isn't there either? Is that the is that the, the catch? I think it is. So if I hold on to their flag, they can't win. Oh, there's actually two people on blue team. So I guess it's like a 3v3? Oh, I thought it was only 2v2. Okay, so I need to, I think that's the idea, is that I can't cash in my flag because of our flag. There we go. Drop that, can I pick it up? I think I returned it. So I now need to get their red flag back to our base, now that our flag is situated. So let's try to do that quick without getting hit. Ready, and that worked. Okay, that's the idea. That makes it a lot more complicated. You need to do a mixture of offense and defense, like our, our flag was just stolen again. Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> We're still in the lead, and it'll be good to steal this flag as soon as possible. There it is. So there they are. I'm gonna wanna hit them with a bowling ball. When they come around the corner here. Wait, oh no, we returned it, good, good, good. Let's keep it moving then. Oh, this person is a red team member. Ready, line it up. Oh no, they dodged it. That was actually pretty good by them. And boom. Oh wow, okay, it was only the three points. We win, that was cool. I like that game mode, that was fun for sure. We get 20 more coins for that, and we are good to change our setup once more. Okay, so game mode number three is gonna be Crystal Grab, but let's do it on a different area. So we have the parking lot. Now this one I'm super unfamiliar with, but it looked pretty fun. Has like, it's obviously based on Tiny Arena. And we'll do Crystal Grab. Get ready and collect the most crystals within the time limit, but don't get hit or you'll pay the price. That's interesting. And we'll just do the three minute time limit then. And we will change our character to Tiny. You know, why not? You know, we are already here. Let's just ready up as fast as we, wait, 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 hold on, it didn't work. There we go, now I'm ready. <laughs> I haven't played as Tiny yet, so this will be interesting. It looks excited. Whoa, okay. Got the giant Tiny statue. Plenty of crystals all over the place, too. This is super fun. Okay, I'm gonna grab as many as I can. That's hard to do, I gotta get used to Tiny's really weird, really lackluster steering. And he's got some good acceleration and stuff, so that'll hopefully make up for it. But if I get hit by anything, that's where the big problems come in. Because I might not be able to uh, hold on to my crystals. Okay, come on, there we go. So lots of people jumping around when it comes to who's leading. Oh, this is cool, this is another new thing. It's invisibility, the weapon technician. I think that means we've used every weapon or every power up in the game now. That's really cool. It's one of my favorites and it's exclusive to battle mode. Ow, I thought that was for a second, I thought that was the clock. That makes everybody go, so oh, look at this cluster over this way. I really need to grab some power up soon though, or I'm gonna be in trouble. So who's in lead? I am! Okay, watch it. Not really too much, ow, going on over this way. <laughs> Dude, 
<laughs> I'm not doing so well with Tiny. I gotta get used to him for sure. Man, I'm not seeing anything anywhere. Where are the crystals at, guys? You stealing all of them? Somehow I'm still in the lead, even with that being the case. I might just be going too fast, though. I have to slow down a little bit. Whoa! They're stealing all the items from me, too! <laughs> oh, no. Oh, gosh. No! I just want to get up one of the ramps. I'm glad I, got, I finally got a power, but where are the crystals? I mean, I guess this, at this point, it looks like there's probably all the crystals we're gonna get, and we just need to knock the rest of them out of the other players. Is that the idea now? I guess so. I thought that the, maybe there'd still slowly be more crystals popping up, but it looks like there's only a finite amount. That's mine. Thank you. I'm at 14. I'm definitely dominating the rest of them. I wonder how many are in total. I got it! Didn't give me anything I wanted. They don't really need speed ups. Tiny moves fast enough as it is. Ready, and got it. Oh gosh, come on, ready. I'm gonna hit you. I don't even know if you have any crystals. I gotta hope. Oh, but I missed you, darn. And I can't, hey, watch it, buddy. What do you think you're doing? Oh, thank you. <laughs> That's karma. Running right into me. Ends up running right into a potion. I'm at 17, can I get the 20 crystals before the time's out? We got 40 seconds left. This is a fun one, for sure. I'm moving, don't hit the TNT, Tiny! Come on, just jump around like crazy, there it is. Oh boy, come on. And the more crystals I have, the more I stand to lose if I get hit, so I'm trying to be, ah, no! <laughs> like that. All right, it looks like my luck has run out a little bit. Oh, I missed it. Darn it, I'm definitely still in the lead. Probably by a good margin. So if I could just play keep away at this point, that probably wouldn't be that bad of an idea. Probably what I should have been doing, but I was greedy! <laughs> oh, that was scary. All right, whoa! Yeah, I had 16 crystals. Second place, it was a three-way tie for second place, and they all had one crystal. So there was only 19 crystals in the game. So at some point, I almost had all of them. Definitely greedy. <laughs> all right, that was a fun game mode, though, for sure. So the next game mode type we'll do on Rocky Road, it is Last Cart Driving. Hit your opponents before they get you, as you have a limited amount of tries to be the last cart standing. Oh, so like we only have like one life or something? Interesting, or like a limited amount of lives. Okay, that, that sounds cool, we'll play as Coco. Rocky Road is one of my favorite tracks though, or like battle arenas. Last Cart Driving seems very interesting. Like I, I hope I'm getting the idea with this one. So we have, oh, so it is sort of like classic Mario Kart battle mode where we have three hearts. That's how Mario Kart is. Usually you have the three balloons and you gotta make sure none of your balloons get knocked out. That'll be interesting for sure. Whoa, okay. <laughs> if I drive fast enough, nobody can hit me, right? That'd be good. It would just be sort of fun to go into a, a big circle. But if I have the chance, I should definitely try to take out some opponents like you. I definitely hit you with the Aku Aku. That's good. Whoa, I'm going down here now, I guess. Not too many item boxes hanging out. Either that, I'm just doing a really bad job of finding them. Is that pinstripe? I think it was. Oh, give me that. Nice. Get another Aku Aku, you're going down. I don't know if that actually hurt you, though. Oh, here I come. Crash Bandicoot eliminated. Three cards to go. That's cool. I mean, there's also a time limit to it. So like obviously whoever I guess has the most lives by the end of it, which hopefully will be me. Okay, where are you? Oh, Pinstripe eliminated, where are you, buddy? Oh, did that not get him? Yikes. I need to get another power up pronto. I wanna not be in trouble. Okay, I see this guy down this way. Oh, that didn't quite get him. Oh, no. Oh well. No, I'm not gonna let you get me. No, oh, got me. Yikes. Still have the super speed boost though. I get another speed boost as if I needed it. Oh boy. There it is, there it is. Ah, oh, just barely, he just barely dodged me. I'm gonna get one of you guys. There it is, Geary eliminated, one cart to go. Let's find out where he is. He's probably right next to me. 
I have this, but I'd rather have an actual power up that I can hit somebody with. I mean, when it said one card to go, does it mean just me? Wait, no, 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 I see somebody over that way. The orange arrow, it'd be weird if I just get to hang out for a few minutes. I'm getting like lots of stuff everywhere. Is that Nash up there? I think it is. Where'd he go? Up! Oh, yeah, we got him! With the backwards bowling ball. All right, very cool. That was a fun one as well. Very intense, perfect map for it too. So I think there's one more game of the checkout, but plenty more maps to go through. So that'll be interesting. So the last game mode type will be on Lab Basement, which is Steal the Beacon, which is, or Bacon, not Beacon. <laughs> Only one bacon left for everyone. No time for sharing, just pick it up and rush to your home portal. So sort of like capture the flag, but like free for all? Huh, we'll try it. Um, and we'll change characters again. We'll just play as Engine. Seems pretty good to me. Okay, well this will certainly be interesting. Let's get going. So Lab Basement, I don't remember at all. I don't know if this was in the original game whatsoever. I'm pretty sure it wasn't. So this is interesting for sure. Okay, I got that. Got some extra one before to start things off. So where is this so-called bacon? It's just right here. Ah, but it's not actually bacon. What color am I, by the way? Am I blue? Let's hope I'm blue. Yeah, okay, no, it's still team basin. I guess it's not really about get, grabbing the enemy's flag and that's sort of the big thing with it. This map is really tiny, so I don't know how functionally good this is for this game mode. After this, I'll sort of go with what I think will be best for whatever map we have. Like I won't sort of choose it in order, I'll just see whatever I think. Okay, Prodigy. <laughs> that was interesting, that, I, I feel like that's fine because that run really didn't have too much to it. It was just sort of a square with some holes. So, I don't know, that one's sort of a meh for me when it comes to the actual map. The game mode's fine. But anyways, we're gonna go to Rampage Ruins. Yeah, this one was in the Lost, uh, the Lost Ruins. So, we'll do, I like Capture the Flag. For a game mode, or for an area like this, I feel like Capture the Flag would be good. So let's give that a shot. Once again, like three, point limit, three points. This seems fine to me. Uh, characters. Maybe I'll just move back to Crash and sort of cycle through those four characters. Something like that might be interesting. Uh, but once again, we'll be showcasing every character sooner or later. Here we are, Rampage Ruins. I like this layout a lot. It was just really tough for the uh, Crystal Challenge on the story mode. So I sort of have bad memories, but here's our, our teammates. We got Entrance, we got Pura. So I'm gonna rush out to their flag as soon as I can. I thought that's the best move I can Really? Yeah, there we go, hope to have. Cause this is a pretty familiar place for me. I was, oh, did that get it? Nice, I think I got rid of the missile with my own thing. That's always good, that do. So three points, let's see how quick we can do that. Got it, score! What's cool about this area? Get out of here, sir! <laughs> Probably should have made it so that, you know, I stuck around to stop him from doing what he was trying to do, ow. Uh, Red team flag picked. Oh, okay. So I just gotta protect you then. You got it. It's Entrance in his his uh, summertime gear. Good job, buddy. Okay, this guy's coming for him. You stop it. Keep going. What are you doing, Trans? Dude, you're, you're right there. I had you protected. You're going the opposite direction. Oh, come on, man. Okay, blue team flag dropped. I don't know exactly where that is. Blue team flag stolen, that's not good. But he's also going the opposite way to the point. Okay, now he's figured it out, he's like, what, I am? Oh, but he missed it. Oh, I can't get him, I can't get him, he keeps missing it. What is he doing? Oh, because there's no flag here for him to get. Oh, I see, that's the problem, is he wants to cash in the flag, but their flag's not there, so they can't. Ow, he knows what he's doing, though. I can do that too, but I missed. I feel like it, it goes slightly off. I, it's funny that I just sort of have to sit here and hit him until he drops the flag. Darn it! <laughs> Come on! We're all just bumping into each other. Give me that flag. It's mine. Move! Move, 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 move. Ah! I got it, right? Okay, I returned it. Score! Okay, that's great. That's what uh everybody was waiting for. So I'm gonna grab this, and we're gonna score that last point now. I'm gonna go as fast as I possibly can. That's it. Come on. I know they're trying to stop me, and he did stop me. Jeez, okay. Good for you, I guess. Don't you dare! Oh, you stinker. I gotta go get it again. 
Oh, but they stole our flag. So I'm gonna have to grab their flag, hit them with the rocket. Of course the rocket missed. That's all it does. Oh no, that was actually my teammate. Never mind. <laughs> okay, that's why. <laughs> okay, so I think that our flag was returned. It doesn't really tell you if it does. It just plays a sound effect, but here we go. Yeah, awesome. Hit and run. So we actually got three to zero there. That's great. And we got another level done. So let's change the level a little bit and see if we want to change anything else with it as well. That should be cool. So next up is the North Bowl. Definitely another new one. 100% for a fact wasn't in the original. That's still cool though. I think that for this one, I think that last car driving would be fun. Let's try this out a little bit more and see how it goes. We'll play as Cortex. The North Bowl looks pretty cool. I really like this one. Can we drive up that? That's what I'm curious about. We're under it right now. So I'm gonna, yeah, there's an item behind me. I'm gonna immediately back up and try to hit a Geary with it. No, I just got a speed boost, oh well. There's a lot of carts in this one. Oh, I see it really is like in a big bowl shape. It doesn't look like there's any way to get on top of the fort in the middle though. That's sort of a shame, but that would've been fun. I have like this like big spiral to climb up. Oh, can I get into there? That'd be fun. Whoop! That was cool. I would have loved to see what this one looked like in the PlayStation 1 days, so it's like a fun concept. I'm positive it wasn't in the original game. Most of those like some kind of weird super secret I never knew about. I don't see how that's possible. Okay. Uh, let's Oh no. It's see that that's definitely like curved to the left a little. That's weird. Oh well. Can I make this jump? No, I'm going out the wrong way. <laughs> Let me get my ten wump of fruit. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Oh, it got me. I tried the dodge at with everything I had, but didn't really work out too well. So I'm down to two hearts already. I'm not doing too well with this. Watch it, guys. Oh, it's very icy up here. You can't stay up here too easily. There's an item. I haven't gotten too many of those so far this round, so I'd like to change that. Oh, we got the invisibility, which will be nice, but Geary already eliminated. Three cards to go. That happened quick. Here, let me get this, and then I'm gonna jump through that. <laughs> I just love the invisibility so much. Like, it looks so cool, it's just like a pair of tires. I don't know what it is. It's probably because it was like that in the original. And this is sort of nostalgic, I guess. Everything about this game is nostalgic, that's the point. Okay, um. Whoa. Let's get you. Got him, see ya, Entropy. Two cards to go, I see somebody up this way. What is he doing? <laughs> He's just like starting and stopping it. It worked out for him, he hit me. I'm down to one heart. That's yes. bad. Ooh, got it. Got another TNT. Oh no, 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 no. I can't catch up, it's too slippery. I'm like a sitting duck right now, I gotta be careful. I'm gonna launch it over that way and hope for the best. Didn't turn out too well. What do I get, what do I get? Nitro. I never get like Aku Aku or Uka Uka or anything. Hmm. Will that get him? No, he turned on the spot. Wow, I just barely dodged that. This is intense between the three of us. We're really going at it. That's mine. No, it's not. Oh, but only a couple of seconds remaining. Will there be like some kind of sudden death or anything? That'd be interesting. If there's like a final showdown between everybody who survives, unless these people have more points than I do. Oh man, I could not do very well. I tied for first. I mean, Zan had three points, so technically he won. But I guess anybody who survives will just tie for first. Interesting, for sure. Uh, but there we go, we got it. <laughs> that is all of the CTR levels, and now we got some of the Nitro Kart ones. Now we have our first CNK uh, battle area. It's a Temple Turmoil. Now I've never seen any of these before. I've never played the battle mode in Nitro Kart, so this will be a totally new experience for me. We'll try Temple Turmoil. I think that would be fun if we do another Crystal Grab. Let's try that out and switch to Tiny again. Oh wait, no wait, no wait, I chose the wrong thing. There we go, we're good. Oh, this looks pretty cool. All the falling stars and meteors and stuff. <laughs> the giant Velo moon. It's always so weird. A lot of crystals in this one. Player one is leading, that's me. 
I think it would just say my character's name. I thought that'd be a little easier to figure out. Oh, let's definitely get this out before somebody hits me. This one seems to be just like a giant circle. But also like with a platform in the center. Nice, what, what just happened? I got pushed. Grab that crystal, come on, I'm missing it so many times. There we go. I think there was another one I missed too. Right now I'm not too worried about it. Just trying to keep moving. Ah, oh, yeah, tiny steering isn't too great, which makes that a bit more difficult. Let's try that again. Got it. Hmm. Oh boy. Yeah, let's grab this one, I'm at 10. I'm in the lead with that too. Oh, here's another one waiting for us. At 11, so let's see if I can't get 20. I feel like the NPCs aren't too good at this uh, game mode specifically. There we go. Oh, whoa, okay, that rocket's ah, coming for me. Luckily nobody was actually here to steal the crystals. Like that's the most important part. You can't just hit people with items in this one. That won't be enough. Here, fire that right at him. Oh, I actually hit him too. That's cool. Oh no, come on, get it, get it, get it. Nice. So what are we at, 17? I mean, who even has crystals to get at this point? Oh, this guy, come on, I can get up to 19. I mean, actually, yeah, I don't think there was more than, you know, there was only 19 last time. So now, I should have all the crystals. I mean, there might be more, who knows? But, that's crazy. Whoa, watch it, definitely get this up. I need to get more Wumpa Fruit so I can get the long-term protection. I don't know if that's actually possible in this game mode. They probably don't let you do that because it'd be overpowered. Whoa, So like he didn't even drop any crystals because he doesn't have any. I've stolen them all. I'm a crystal monster. You'd think that would just like automatically end the game. Like I just win by forfeit. Let me get this fruit. Or not. They really like taking the fruit from me. But well, I'm gonna get this one. Oh no, 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 no. Up, oh, up. Oh, I tried to throw the rocket at, not the rocket, the, uh, the bomb at it. Didn't quite work. Come on, no, my. Ah, well, <laughs> this is going all wrong. All wrong. Give me that. <laughs> no, I'm like super stuck. There it goes. Okay, there it is. My crystal. I'm back at the 19. <laughs> oh, wait, there is one over here. Can I get a 20th crystal? There it is. Okay, so you do win if you get all of them. That's so cool. Awesome. So I got every single crystal. I win. Let's change the level. Next up is Frozen Frenzy. Definitely takes place in that like one oil drill map. We will do, let's do, I actually, we'll just do limit battle. I'll also put like a, uh, is there a point limit I can put on here? I guess we'll, by points, we'll do, we'll do five points. Limit by five points. I feel like that goes by a little bit faster and seeing how there's a lot to check out, that might be for the best. We still have like this map and like three or four more to go. So it, it's taken a while for sure, but they're all really cool. I would love to hear what is your favorite battle mode map? And maybe at some point we'll go online with all this. I thought that'll be fun. But like I said, I want to sort of showcase everything and I can't really control what shows up when online. So at some point we'll do online battle mode. It'd be a ton of fun. If that's even a thing we can do. I'm not really sure. It might just be online races, but that'd be sort of a shame. This is a cool looking track so far. So we just gotta score five points. Whoa. Whoa, so we got some like spinning things. Did I get him? I missed him. Yikes. Like sometimes, oh, I, I did I hit somebody there? Suppose I did. All right, totally intentional. I meant to do that, ow. And I meant to do that too. Or anybody says anything otherwise. So every time you press X, you get a boost. I didn't realize that's how that works. So I'm already at two points, I just need three more. Oh, and a rock is definitely gonna help me with that, but it missed. Oh boy, watch it. I don't know if getting hit makes me lose a point. Invisibility, yes it does. Yikes, that'll actually make this a whole lot difficult, or more difficult. But invisibility will help with that. I'm glad we got the, uh, you know, get every weapon trophy, or use every weapon. No, come on. But they're losing points as well. I think I'm still leading. I just need to actually catch up to somebody and hit them with this. And I prefer to have a rocket. There we go. Thank you, game. Give me three of them. Watch. Out. There it is. Player one's leading. And then when you get back up, I, I, I'm sorry to be so mean. That didn't work. Okay. Well, that was a waste of a rocket. I know my lesson now. I learned my lesson. 
I'm at four points. I just need one more. Well, let's make this rocket count then. Yeah, there it is. Purr, poor purr, I had negative three points. And we earned the trophy, the Dominator. Very cool. The smack Man, I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but that's like our little, I guess, nickname we get for some kind of performance we had with this. Anyways, there's that done. Let's get some more tracks checked out. I'm having a lot of fun with this though, for sure. Uh, so now we have Desert Storm, and then two more after that. Desert Storm, can't really tell too much what's going on with this one, so we're gonna do Steal the Bacon again. I feel like it's supposed to say Steal the Beacon. I'm gonna do six points, because three points went by really fast. And we'll do Engine again. Let's get going. So this is looking pretty cool. Let's get going, ready? Oh man, that the, the distance here, like just looking out in the distance looks really cool. This is clearly based off of uh, the, the clock level. Anyways, where is the bacon? I need to find it. Might be up there. Okay, this is super cool actually. Let me get up this way. And then, is it gonna be, yep, in here. Flag picked, somebody got it. This guy did. Oh, just barely missed the dude. Okay, so red team scored, but now I am going to score. So I'm on the blue team. It seems like that's like an automatic thing. I'm on the wrong way if I wanna get up there. Well, no, wait, 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 did I score? Okay, no, I scored. That's cool. We need to get back up, though. Yeah, I thought it was up here. That is a little confusing. I got the flag. Flag picked. So you don't have to worry about your enemies at all. This map's a little weird for this, though, because you just gotta plop down and you score. It's actually pretty easy if people don't know what you're looking for. That's weird. But this is why I made it six points instead of three, because that's just gonna go by really fast. Especially seeing how I'm just sort of doing the same thing over and over again. I feel like Capture the Bacon might be the weakest game mode then. Just because of how it works, you know? You can just sort of like, just keep driving and not run into anybody. Which can be fun, like maybe online when people sort of know a little bit more about what they're doing. But here, not so much. Okay, looks like somebody else got it. Might have been Oxide or something. So I just want to stay up here, and as soon as that guy scores, I could go and help him out, but he doesn't need it. He knows what he's doing. Okay, let's get point number five, and then like all I have to do is drive, fall, boom, point, and that's it. It's that easy. The easy as one, two, three. Engine's a fun character though. Can't wait to showcase him. He's got I think the same stats as Coco, who has some really nice stats. And ready. Let's win this. Very cool, fun area. That actually may be one of my favorite battle modes because I like the cool jump, for sure. But there we go, blue team, six to one. We dominated them as per usual. Looks like the NPCs just aren't very good at battle mode. Next up is Magnetic Mayhem. Oh, interesting. I like it. So this one we will do, I think we'll do last card driving. Sounds like fun to me. I feel like it gives us like the most experience with the map. And characters, I'll go all the way back to Crash again. We're good to go, so let's get started. Oh, okay. This is cool. What do these exclamation marks do? Whoa, they do a little squish. That's scary, so you can get a bunch of items back here, but you can also totally get squished. Ah, hey, it pushed me. Did that take a life away? Of course it does, what a stinker. So that is so risky. Geary's already eliminated three carts to go. Ow, what a jerk. They're tearing me up right now. I just wanna sort of like do this over and over again. I just hit myself! That doesn't count, right? Okay, it doesn't count. Thank goodness. That would've stunk if I just eliminated myself. What's out here? Oh, there's a lot of good. This one's a bit more roomy. Zam eliminated two cards to go. Not including myself. Okay, I want that invisibility big time. So I think more of the same on this side most likely. You bet. Is this like a teleporter then what does this do? Nothing. Okay, I thought it was gonna be able to teleport me to the other side. That would've been cool. Oh, look at this. I do get the uh, indefinite thing and the rocket. So I'm gonna try to just ram right into somebody if I can. Yeah, like that. And then turn around and fire this. Yeah, that got him. That's mine. Throw down the nitro. Oh, that's a dead end. Okay, that's how that works. <laughs> Good to know. I don't know where they went. Okay, they're back in here. Okay, you guys, Dingo Dial eliminated. It's just him. I know he's on his last point too. Oh, 
Oh, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. No, I'm not. I, I gotta get something else. Now. Oh, man, that was close. He was going right for me. <laughs> that was so scary, but we win. There, just barely. So there should be one more track left to go. That was a blast for sure. <laughs> it's been so much fun. Um, but yeah, we'll check out the Terra Drome. Can't really see too much what's going on here, but I feel like it'd be fun for Capture the Flag. So that's what we're gonna get started with. Uh, we will choose Cortex. Ooh. And ooh, we're ready. So here we are at the last battle mode map. It's the Terra Drome, which is obviously based off of uh, Tiny Jungle or whatever it is. Um, but as you can see, it has like the big tiny statue holding up some stuff. Very weird, but I do like it. So their flag is just on the other side of this, so I should probably grab some extra Wampa Fruit. Whoop. Oh, I missed it, just barely. Come on, come on. All right, I got the flag. They don't seem to have gotten our flag yet. Haven't seemed to have gotten it. Oh no, that they got it now. Okay, so I gotta get to them and stop them at all costs. Because I can't score if they have that. Oh, oh, nice, nice. So I'm gonna run into that so they don't have it anymore. And then I gotta skedaddle quick. That's it, because they're gonna be doing the same thing to me soon enough, I'm not careful. There it is, we got that score. First point of three. We're moving now. Lots of different ways you can go though, which is cool. Ow, okay, they stole our flag. Our teammates have stolen ours, or theirs now, so that's good. Where are you then, buddy? Because I'm gonna hit you with a rocket, just dead on. Return our flag so that this dude right here can get the second point, there's our score. I'm going for it. Nice! Oh gosh, watch out. Guy has uka uka power. Oh gosh, come on, come on, jump for it! Hey, wait, do you have our flag? I don't think you did. Actually, that was my teammate, wasn't it? Our flag's fine, so if I go like this, I should be able to get it. Oh, there it is, blue team wins! Very cool bragging rights. So yeah, we beat them pretty well there. And yeah, that's it, that is every single battle mode game mode, as well as every battle mode map. That was a ton of fun for sure. Now, I don't think I have enough coins for the pit stop right now, but I might as well take a look at it at the least over this way, the pit stop, see what's available. I wanted to save up my money for the summertime pack. It's a little expensive, 7,200, so I'm just gonna keep earning up until we have that. So I'm not gonna spend anything in today's episode, but very cool to see for sure. But yeah, I had a ton of fun there, hopefully you guys did too. And with that being said, let me know your thoughts on the battle mode game mode, all the types of modes, the types of maps. I would love to hear your thoughts on all of it, which ones were your favorite, all that kind of stuff. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled. If you watched this point of video, make sure you comment Zebra Battle, so you've watched at the end of the URA Zebra Task Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.